seconds and counting. Hey, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. It's Nisha, and we have some news for y'all. The Rockets have made a move, and they signed free agent center Willie Cauley-Stein to a one-year deal, and he will compete for a roster spot in training camp. So either this deal is not very guaranteed, or they're going to wait to sign him. And currently, the Rockets have 20 players, and that's the maximum amount of players you can have on a roster. So you can expect the Rockets to waive a player soon. And a lot of people are predicting it could be one of the four Dallas players that we acquired from the Christian Wood trade. And three of them, Marquise Chris, Sterling Brown, and Trey Burke, have been reported to not stick around. So we could waive one of those guys. Uh, and Marquise Chris is injured currently, so who knows? He might be the guy to get released, but it's kind of a really random signing, not going to lie. I kind of wonder what this means for either Garuba being the backup center on this team or Bruno Fernando, who has shown some flashes. I think it is to make it competitive in training camp. I don't, I'm not sure if Willie Colley Stein will win over them, but... In his, in his recent playing time, he hasn't really shown a lot. He hasn't played a lot, actually. He's been played under 10 minutes a game, has scored 1.7 1, 1. points a game, and has been shooting an abysmal 45% from the field. And in the past, he seemed like a pretty good player to have. In terms of depth-wise, he looked like a really good rim runner, decent rim protector, was a solid rebounder in those Kings days, and he had really good athletic gifts for a seven footer. But I think his demise kind of came from him trying to do too much and trying to play out of his role. So if the Rockets can keep him in his role, that would be a huge win. If he does get minutes, I don't expect him to take too many minutes from Shingun. I hopefully he'll be a more so of a low usage type of guy. And Silas coached him up in the 2019-2020 season when Willie Colley signed was on the Mavericks. So maybe Silas knows a way to utilize him to his strengths. And we'll see from there. But we definitely need help at the backup center position as a place where we can always improve. And that's pretty much it for the video. Let us know your thoughts on the signing. And as always, be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Thank y'all for watching. Peace.